I wasn't gonna make a video. Uh, the diagnosis was quick, simple, um, but I wanted to make a quick tip video. So let me show you the codes that it had. It was running rough. Uh, it wouldn't stay running. You could, it would start up, uh, idle really rough, and then die. And you could keep it running uh, if you gave it a little throttle. It would stay running, but as soon as you let off, it'd want to die. Check engine light, pulled codes. Let me show you what the codes were. So these are the codes P0011, and there's a history code, current code, pending code. So these are all the same codes in the system. This B1650, that's for the airbag, so that's not, not our uh, drivability issue. But the 0011, camshaft timing over advanced. So many cars on the road utilize variable cam timing to get the optimum performance at all sorts of uh, RPM ranges. How variable timing works, and some cars are, are a little different, but the majority of cars use an oil control valve and a phaser on the end of the camshaft. That phaser will move counterclockwise or clockwise depending on the amount of oil pressure allowed into the phaser. Now there's lots of videos to get more in depth, but the main idea with this video is that it uses oil pressure. So you need uh, enough oil in the system to make it operate. So the quick tip, if you have cam position codes, whether it's over advanced or under advanced, and you know your vehicle has a variable cam timing system, uh, VVT, um, VTEC, whatever your vehicle is, not just Toyota, but all sorts of vehicles have variable cam timing. If yours does, you have a cam timing code, check the oil level first. Before you dig deep into diagnostics, just real quick, it's simple, check the oil level. Um, if you're good, it's full, then you know proceed. But you'd be surprised how often low oil can cause uh, this kind of code. Just wanted to show you real quick. The oil level on this, there's zero oil on this dipstick. One more time. Nothing. So now we're under the vehicle. Let's pull the drain plug and see how much actually comes out. Should've wore gloves. All right, let's go measure how much came out. All right, not sure how well you can see my graduation marks. I got one, two, two and a half, three, three and a half, and four quarts. All right. So you can see we're just below the two quart uh, little hatch there. So less than two quarts in this vehicle. Well, there you go, that's the quick tip. If you have cam codes for over advanced or uh, retarded, check the oil level first. This had less than half the oil that this system holds that had an effect on the variable cam timing uh, system causing all sorts of drivability issues. Did the oil change? We're back up and running. It could be just that simple. All right, well, thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe. See you on the next one.